won your entire army, understand right. <laughs> yes, but more peace. Do not let Optimus know that. Shh, shh, shh. Just don't say anything. Something wrong, Bumblebee. Who was you talking to? Sam. But Sam isn't here. I just dropped him off back at his house. He groundbridged here. Then, where is he? Ratchet. Shrunk him with a shrink ray again. What shrink ray? Exactly. Ah, damn it. That's plan A gone. Any ideas, anyone? Hmm. Remember when Megatron came to the base and said. Come out and get your Christmas present, and sideswap the fell for it? Let's do that. Are you fracking crazy? That will just remind Optimus it's Christmas. It's Christmas? Frag. Megatron, guess what? Did you blink then? Isn't that how humans swear? Well, kind of yeah. But that's how I say, finally! Let's get the party on! What was you and Bumblebee talking about? The whole thing that Autobots and Decepticon army is gonna keep it to themselves that it's Christmas Day. For me, but I'm not supposed to. Oh, for the love of Primus! It's okay, guys. You can come out. Holidays starting again. Why do you not want me to celebrate Christmas, Bumblebee? Hate to break it to you, Primus, but you celebrate Christmas way. Too much. I do not. You're right. I do. Yes, I am right. So, the only thing I'm going to do now to fix this problem, the only logical thing what I could do to fix this is to celebrate Christmas even more. Please, that's like, wait, 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 what? Everyone, it's party time. Yeah. Come on, B. Give Christmas a try, at least. I don't hate Christmas. I hate people who celebrate it. That's why. I cannot stand it. Why? What happened? You're supposed to give to the less fortunate at Christmas. So, the Decepticon prisoners, when we, what we captured when we were filming, we forgot to untie them after filming. So, I went down to the Decepticon prisons, cooked them a Christmas meal.
I threw it in my face. I embarrassed him in front of all Cybertronians. I'm sorry. Uh, wanna go for a ride, bud? Sure. Whoa! What just happened? Where are we? We are in the past. Is this what they did to you? Yes, Saucy. I'm sorry, but I gotta go. No, look at them. When we're filming next, kick the scrap out of them. <clears throat> I guess so. But I remember the next day I went back to training school. The bots. They... They gave me a hard time, see? Now is this what happened? Yeah. Well, it's the thought that counts. It's better than nothing. Anything? Even nothing is better than getting the scrap kicked out of you and hung on a Christmas tree in front of everyone. You know what I meant. Now, to the present. Is there gonna be ghosts in this Scrooge thingy, or is it just me and you? Me and you. Okay, then that's fine. Now look at him. He's enjoying Christmas. That's what you want, isn't it? For your leader and our friends to be happy at Christmas, right? I guess so. I guess so, I'll see. Yeah. So? So what? So, are you going to celebrate Christmas? Hmm. Uh, yeah, guess so. You watch. He'll be Ratchet, Flack, or Robot, or even Optimus Prime next year, who's a grumpy Scrooge. Wouldn't you agree, Optimus? He can't see you. These are shadows of the present, past, and future. Can't touch them. We're basically not here. We are the ghosts. Hey, you lied to me. What? No, I did not. Yes, you did. You said there were going to be no ghosts. No, no. They exist in their own time. We are the ghosts. Oh. Okay then, shall we move on? Sure. Now, unless you change your ways, this is where you'll end up. In the next episode. The Decepticon Army? Never. Transformers Fan 5000 will never write that in the script. Never. Take me back. These are the vision of what may be, not what shall be, isn't it? Yes, but unless you change your ways, it's back to being grumpy and evil and old, eventually. Okay, okay. I'll celebrate Christmas. I'll not be a Scrooge. After all, it's about spending time with friends and family. Yeah. Let's go back to base. Finally. Whoa! We're back. Yay! Not a word to anyone. Our little secret. Hey, Bumblebee. Over here. You ready for the Christmas dinner? <laughs> yes, I am. Me. And I'll see. Well, it looks like my work here is done. Optimus! What have you done? What? Whoa, B, remember! 
It's a base, not science workshop. Oh yeah. Sorry. Good job anyway. Two years ago, remember. Two years ago I tricked you. Making you cook twice in two days. <laughs> Since it was Christmas Eve. How about you all watch a movie and I cook dinner tonight and tomorrow. Payback for me making you cook twice last year, eh? You know how to cook, right, Bumblebee? Oh yeah, piece of cake. How do you make cake? I'll see. Will you help me? Sure, B. Thanks, Arcee. How about the Polar Express, everyone? Oh boy, yes. Uh, but I have to co cook. Well, I guess I can listen to it and just watch while it's cooking. So what shall we cook? Don't worry, Arcee. I have an evil plan. Ho ho ho, oh damn it. Ha 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 ha. I have a very evil plan. I shall cook that prime turkey. You don't even know how to cook prime style. No, really. There's such a thing as a prime turkey. Well, I think so. I think it's like the best quality of one. Anyway, I don't know. Let's just call it prime. <sighs> anyway, let's get to it. What are you doing, really? An invite to the North Pole to see the one and only Santa Claus. And you're turning it down, kid. Well, I guess he could be a kidnapper. Prime, here. He wants to give you this. A model of me? Thanks, Bumblebee. I really like it. Now let's serve up dinner and watch films and wait for the day. The day till all are one? No, I mean Christmas Day, B. Oh, right, uh, yeah. <laughs> Sorry. Can't believe I forgot about that. What's that noise? C could it be the Polar Express train? Well, you're coming. Ultra Magnus? You're a train conductor? Me no no, Ultra Magnus. I just woke up from my recharge cycle. I don't want to play games right now. So, you're coming or not? Where? Why to the North Pole, of course. This is the Polar Express. Can't believe this is happening. It's gotta be a dream or something. I just watched this movie a few hours ago. All right, Mags, I'll come along for the ride with you, sir. Awkward. Now I see why that kid thought about this. Many hours later, and we're still traveling. Scrap this. I'm going to the front of the train. This train better not be named Astro Train. Hmm. 
she is believing. Starscream, they hired you for this part. The ghost of Starscream. I ride this train for free, you know. <laughs> How about a nice hot cup of energon? Ghost of nothing if you don't shut up. Finally, we're here. There's Santa. Yes, there he is. And he shall pick you to open the first gift of Christmas. Really? Prime, you're not Santa. I am now. Okay. Oh, I have a present for you. Here's a sword thingy. Nice, yeah. Slice and dice. Now I look like the center of the Argus advert. Oh, well, at least I can scare some kids for Halloween. Oh, oh, oh I, I need. Oh, sorry. Face it, you needed to cut your beard anyway. We better get back. Groundbridge back to base. I shall deliver the kids around the world a present and come home, RC. Yes, Prime? Merry Christmas. Same to you, Optimus. Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. Well, it's Christmas Day, everyone! Santa's been here! <sighs> What's up, Optimus? I missed him. Surely I got him on camera. Someone check. No, I missed him again. I think you'll find there's more to you than meets the eye. So there it is, as we celebrate Christmas opening presents and cooking dinner, we thank you for watching this Christmas special. Stay tuned until then. Merry Christmas to all, and to all, a good night.